So today we are going to talk about uniform discrete distribution. So in a uniform discrete distribution, a random variable x follows a uniform distribution with parameter n. As the discrete distribution, we are having a probability mass function. So the mass function is given by 1 upon n, where n is always greater than 0. Now we are calculating mean and variance of the uniform discrete distribution. We are using expectation method for calculation. First, the calculation of mean, which is the summation of x into f of x from x is equal to 1 to infinity. So the summation term is now equal to 1 upon n into the summation of 1 plus 2 plus 3 up to n which is 1 upon n into n into n plus 1 by 2 and eventually the mean will come as n plus 1 by 2. Now the variance, so the variance is expectation of x square minus expectation of x whole square. So you can see on expanding the term, we are getting 1 upon n into the summation of 1 plus 2 square plus 3 square up to n square minus n plus 1 by 2 whole square. The summation of 1 plus 2 square plus 3 square is equal to n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 whole divided by 6. On cancelling the terms, we are getting n plus 1 by 2 into n minus 1 by 6. Finally, we are getting the variance as n square minus 1 by 12. We are having a second method named as moment generating function for calculating the mean and variance. So in this method, we calculate a term named as mx of t, which is simply the expectation of e power tx. So using this method, we can get the mx t as e power t divided by n into 1 minus e power t. Likewise, we are having cumulant generating function and at the end, we are having function named as moments for calculating the mean and variance. In this function, what we do, we derivate the mx t with t equal to 0. The first derivation will give us the mean you can see all the calculations done on the screen. So the first derivative is giving us n plus 1 by 2, which is the mean. It is, a, it is same as what we got in expectation method. Now we are calculating the second derivative with t equal to 0. So on Simplifying the expression, we are getting something as 1 upon n into e power t plus 4 into e power 2t plus 9 into e power 3t with t equal to 0. And eventually, we will get the simplified version as 1 upon n into n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 by 6, which will finally evaluate to n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6. On subtracting the first derivative square from the second derivative, we'll get something as n square minus 1 by 12, which is the variance. So we found the mean and variance using this method. Thank you.